Greetings YouTube, Marvin Ford with Great American Survival. This weekend we're doing a double feature. We've already done the first one. If you didn't see it, we did a Stanley stainless steel growler. This is our second video of the day. Um, we, we're reviewing, we've, I received this hybrid, hybrid light in a battle box that I received a few months ago. Uh, referring one for about, um, they called it blackout. It was all about uh, solar powered everything. And this right here is an amazing light. Um, it's a hybrid light, looks like that. It's a 75 lumen, solar powered, expandable flashlight and charging station. This right here is a solar powered light. We have had this thing for a few months and we have used the living daylights out of it. We have enjoyed having it. It's a 75 lumen flashlight like that, but it's also an expandable lantern has a little hook for you to hang it by a piece of paracord, which we have done. And we've also just hung it on the inside of our family tent when we go family camping. But when I'm camping by my, with my, our group, with our scout group, um, I carry it and I hang it off my um, ridge line of my hammock. And it's, it's bright enough I can read by at night and it's bright enough where I can use it if I wake up and I've dealt with uh, the last couple times we've camped, we've been in bear country. So when I wake up and I want to look around. I don't want a flashlight that's overbearing, that's over blinding or anything like that. This thing doesn't do that, but I also usually have my little my little red light. The red light is up there also, but this one right here right lights up really well. Has a low and it has a high setting. And it also has a little sensor on the side over here that lights up red and lets you know when it's charging. Like right now, it's a, the red light's on because I'm outside. Even in a low light situation like this, when it's still charging. Every time we've camped, we've used this since the very first time. The first time we used it, my son ran his phone down to nothing. Uh, we used it to charge my phone, my wife's phone, which ours were only about 30%, 40%. Charged all both of our phones up and his completely up, back to 100%. All three of those phones. It's, it usually says it's only gonna give you two phones, you know, out of one day's, but it charges during the day charges off of any type of ambient light like inside a house it's still producing that kind of light that works with the solar unit this thing is amazing guys um, we've really enjoyed it and um, it stays in my day bag it goes with me everywhere um, if I know I'm going camping I take it out I sit it up in the little cutout pocket on the dash of my f-150 and let it charge and that way it's fully charged it's loaded it's ready to go and um, this thing works great um, I try not to use it for this battery pack charger part because um it's just you know I'd, I'd rather not use it for that because one i'm not a big electronics person when i'm camping i don't really like that i almost got hit with an acorn by a squirrel that was messed up did you hear that and um that says on their website that the you can leave this thing fully charged you can charge it up and put it in your bug out bag and leave it there for two years without any diminishment of its charge that's intense that's really cool. Um, for for the multi-purpose function of what this thing's capable of, that's awesome. It's also water resistant, you know, because this part here is a, an encapsulated little unit. This part up here is just an opening, but it's just got the LEDs coming out of the top. But it's a pretty, it's like a hockey puck. It's only about, I think they say, it says on the website, it's two inches tall. But um, it's lightweight, it works great. Um, if you're looking for something like this and you want to look at like a solar powered backup Just a charging station. Those are cool. This has a little more purpose for for itself than that And it makes it a little more useful in my eyes um, If you're looking for something like this check them out pick them up. They're not very expensive. They're less than 40 bucks um, And it's a great unit. I mean it really is um, If you're new to great American survival, we try to do at least a couple week videos a week We do at least one every Wednesday if you subscribe below or right over there in that corner, you can subscribe and we'll send you, uh, YouTube will send you an alert every time I post a new video. Uh, check them out, come and join us. Welcome, we, we'd love to have you aboard. Um, come on board, stay with us, tell us what you think, give us some feedback, tell me what you want me to check out next. Something that you're looking at, if there's a piece of gear out there that you're looking at trying out and you wanna know more about, I might already have it. You sit there and tell me about it, I just have it, I have a lot of equipment and a lot of gear and most of it's just stuff I haven't tried out yet. I haven't done videos on. You tell me what you wanna see next. 
I'll be happy to try and do it, okay? Hope everybody's having a great week. Get out there and enjoy nature. We love to have it, have everybody out there enjoying at least one day every weekend. Um, God's given us an amazing world to live in. Doesn't matter what part of the country it is, there's some beautiful stuff around you. Um, get out there, educate yourself, start learning about nature, start learning how to defend yourself, learning how to survive, make yourself a better person, read a book. We'd love to have you around. Um, education is a value. Pick one of these up, be prepared, stay safe, and God bless. We'll talk to you later, guys.